everyone, my name is Blue. Welcome to a brand new video. You know what time it is? It's time for you to die. <laughs> Hello everybody, this is Jack and welcome to a brand new live stream. and today we are going to finish off what we left to do in Mad Father. There's a few things I wanted to guide you through. So you have seen um, that we um, explored pretty much all the game, um, all of the game ex expect a few um, except sorry, except a few uh, achievements that we haven't looked at yet. There are a few things that we never actually got to find in the game. So I'm going to go back and try to play. So meanwhile, while we um um while, while we look at it, um let me know because we might probably have a second stream if this one is short enough. Uh and I may come back with a new game to play. Now, I will I will ask you to um give your suggestions for a very short horror game that you can find. If you can think of anything really, really short that I can do like in an hour, let me know, okay? I'll let you know if I'm going to uh, create another uh, game, uh, sorry, another stream, I got confused there for a second, so I I'm going to let you know if I'm going to do a second stream, if this one is too long or not, so we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Um, so you, you guys tell me if you have any ideas of any game, short game, very short game, for an hour only, that I can finish in an hour. Let me know, just a small experience for Halloween, all right? And no, Mother 3 is not one of those games. It's exactly what I don't want, because it's huge. <laughs> so I need something for an hour. If you guys can figure out one hour, um, leave your suggestions in, um, in the chat, something that I can finish really quickly. That doesn't require me to go back and look for, for stuff for hours and hours on end. Uh, or that has too much story for us to go through. All right. A very short experience you can think of is 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 welcome. Besides that, don't forget to check out the links in the description. Um, we have ways to support the channel, ways to support the the charity uh, Child's Play um, with the T-shirts and all, all that. You can also find mugs if you don't like T-shirts. You can find a mug for you to drink your uh, coffee in the morning or your tea. Or uh, whatever, even eat your cereals in it. I I don't care. You do whatever. Um, <laughs> we have uh, the blue blog, which is uh, uh, the Tumblr page that we have. It's basically the central where you find um, all, if most, if not all, the content uh, and a little bit extras as well. Uh, Discord is actually the most active um, place uh, that we are in. Uh, you can find us uh, on Discord. Um, most of the people watching the stream also will be there, so it's it just chat on, uh, share your stuff there, have some fun. Um, and we have Twitter, Facebook, and DeviantArt as well, so um, all those places you can check out and, uh, and uh, be part of the community, which we're slowly building. 10 years of Blue Jack G, guys. 10 years. 
We're almost done with the 10th, 10th anniversary. Um, I mean, it's been it, it since March, I guess. Um, not March. Yeah, March. Yeah. Um, that we uh that the channel made a 10 years. Um, so um, until then, we're still gonna continue on. Today's Halloween special. Not Halloween itself, but Halloween special. And because we have this month of Halloween going on, we have a raffle going for Halloween as well. A raffle where you can actually enter by just putting a drawing and expecting to win by chance. So um, make sure... Uh, it, this is going on on Discord, so if you want to join in, you can join to participate in that raffle and, and get a poster or a mug or anything, really. Uh, the the price right now is, is uh, announced as being a mug of the artwork of blue you see in the corner right now on the left bottom left corner you see that artwork yeah that's that's the one you're gonna have in a mug uh, as a prize but there might be more prizes uh, for the winner so stay tuned for that um, and if you and again if you want to participate it's just a matter of joining and putting your artwork there and waiting for the votes and uh, after that you you get you get selected randomly so um, all right this game, this game, if you say Mother 3, one more time, I will break you. <laughs> I just said once. Or do you mean, uh, kid? <laughs> Stardew Valley is technically not finishable. <laughs> oh, man. No, no, that's not the kind of game I want either. Uh, I know Stardew Valley is cool, but it's not for Halloween. I mean, Halloween themed, a scary game, a horror game, you know? Uh, that's what I'm looking for, um, obviously, for this Halloween special. Uh, other games will come later, probably, but, but now for this month, let's focus on horror games and experiences that we can play um, that uh, match the feel of Halloween. That would be best. That would be best. All right, so um, thank you for everyone. Last time, I was incredible. Thank you for everyone who donated. Thank you for everyone who put participated in the stream. Uh, in 10 minutes, we're going to start this next part, which is um, because we left the true ending to do and because I missed one detail in the game. So if you guys know me and, and actually uh, have me on Steam, uh, you know that I already got the achievement for that, what which we missed. But I'm going to let you know when that happens. It's really, it's part of what we're going to do today. So, and trust me, I have, I've been looking down the whole time to not see what happens when you discover Maria's diary. That's what it, what exactly we're gonna do today. Find Maria's diary. I know where it is, but for the purpose of this stream and to not waste your time, I am going to be in a specific spot in the game. I have several saves to show you, so that's what we're gonna do. Slender Man's stuff is simple and quick. Well, Slender Man's stuff is best in multiplayer, isn't it? Um... That would be something to do with friends someday. Um, but yeah, um, I mean, there are some. I know there are some. I don't know the names of them, so I can't really look them up. But I know there are some like small RPG Maker games that are horror-oriented and are really quick to play. You can play them in a, f in a few minutes and get the experience. Or, or not even an RPG game, an uh, RPG Maker uh, created game. About something else, some some other platform, some other game. I know there are those quick experience games that you can play, and you can, and like in 30, 30 minutes, you beat the game. So um, that's what I'm looking for: something soft, so something not not soft, but like quick. <laughs> that's what I mean. Um, I know they exist. I've seen some of them, um, but uh, I, I I'm terrible with names, so I completely forgot what they are. Uh, <laughs> um, but the, yeah, the, the, there's that kind of game around. So um, if you if you if you remember, um, or if you want to look it up while you watch the stream, that's possible as well. Um, but meanwhile, we're waiting for people to come. We have four people watching right now, so I expect uh, um, more people to join soon. Uh, I don't want to go and start the game right away because the streams are set to the hour that's coming basically um i don't know what time it is for you but it is for me um 10 uh, 10 53 p.m so 
at 11 is when the stream usually starts and I kind of want to respect that so people know that okay at that time I'll be here and I know it's going to start. Um, this is just the introductory part so people know the stream has started and start to join and uh, don't go anywhere uh, unless you want to go grab some snacks and come back that's cool too. Um, but yeah if you um, stay and chill um, seven minutes to go. If you have any questions let's let's hear them. Um, yeah, uh, so meanwhile, we're, we're gonna look for the last, uh, the last few achievements that we missed, um, and, and, um, yeah, it's gonna be spoiler heavy today. I know that last time we got a bad end, so technically you could consider this not as spoilery as today, but today, if you wanna experience my father in any way, make sure, uh, you're aware that, um, this is going to be the endings of Mad Father and and how to get them, um, and I'm going to, to go through the achievements. I I, I I shouted last time. I shouted achievement every time I got an achievement. I got pretty much all of them except for the true ending, the um, bad ending one, the um, Maria's diary ending one ending that is very specific to looking at something at the right time, which I haven't done, and I'm going to show you that. Um, I, I say, I'm saying, I'm going to show you that like I know what it is, but I don't even know what it is. I'm just thinking because that the achievement's name is about Jigsaw and the only time we saw a Jigsaw puzzle of some sort, it was with a picture of, of, of Aya. So we're going to, we're going to take a look at that and, and see what's up. So I have a save there. Um. And uh, I, I'm curious to know if, if it's necessary to look at that, if it's exactly what's going on. The other one is uh, unlock a secret. And um, there's the ending for the if, which is an option right there. If you can see it on screen. This option unlocks if you get the true end, I believe, because we already finished the game once. So don't worry, I have chips. Make sure you guys are in sync with the stream because I have this set to low latency. So um, you should see, you should hear me talk right away, and I should see your messages as they pop up. If your stream is in sync, as far as it can be, uh, to sync a stream on YouTube, on your your play window, you have to click the um, live text. That's it, the little ball, red ball, and, and it says live right next to it. If you click it, um, it will bring you to the to to the most recent moment in the live stream, so you can be in sync. Um, just, just click there, and you should you, your your bar should automatically jump to the to the moment, the closest moment to me, basically. Got a mini scotch egg because yeah, yeah. I'm looking at your answers, and the, the answers seem a little bit, you know, late compared to um compared to uh, what I've said. And it should be only a few, a matter of one second most, uh, with low latency or two. There's ultra low latency, which is pretty much extremely live, so it's a hundred percent like you're here with me. <laughs> For you, I have like m uh, less than a second of delay, probably. <laughs> uh, so it's 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 different, yeah. But I'm going for low latency, so it doesn't strain too much on me, uh, on my um, internet. But yeah, um, that that's that's pretty much it. Can you see my mouse? I don't think you can. I think I hit the mouse. Yeah. That's good. That's good. So I can mouse over how I want, and it doesn't bother you. Um, right. So um, seems like uh, we uh, we're still the same four as before. So welcome, guys. Thank you for coming. Um, tell you what. If uh, if um, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say something. If we can get all the achievements today, that would be great. Um, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get them all. Uh, for what I understood, uh, I'm not sure if, I'm not sure of how you collect them. But uh, and I don't have the list in front of me right now, so I can't tell you whether or not, um, uh, which ones. Let me give, give it a shot. Let me, let me open Steam real quick. Mad Father. Achievements. Red Jigsaw, one of the achievements. Then the other one is Charm of Happiness. Unlock image, Charm of Happiness. So I don't know what it is. I don't know how to unlock the picture. I assume you have to do the true end or something. 
Then you have Love is Madness, which is the bad ending one. Uh, the Promise, the true ending. Aya's Future, see the if ending. Uh, and um, Familiar Face, unlock a secret event. That's pretty much how we, how we stand right now. We'll see. And yeah, you may see the um. Oh, there you go. So you can you can uh, you can check out achievements right there. I can show it to you right now. Because it will show up on stream. So as you can see, the, these are the achievements of Steam. And I'm I'm happy that they show up. <laughs> so um. As you can see, let me see if I can scroll down further. Come on. I think that's it. There you go, Maria. That one I already got, but that's because I was running the game to get to the point where we could actually play it and 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 skip most of the story. There's a way to actually go uh post well, have the the text go faster by holding B on the controller, which must be an X in uh in um on the keyboard, so I'm not sure exactly, but but you can like skip text, you can like make the text go really really fast. So it's really good if you want to skip a portion of the story if you've already seen it, um, and that helps me to get to to this point. Um, I screwed up my saves at one point; I had to restart and do over, <laughs> but that's fine. Um, now I have all the saves all organized. So yeah, it's time. <laughs> so let's get started. Alright, give me a moment, there you go, music. Alright, so, Mad Father, what a great experience so far. Um, it's it's a very, very well made game, um, for what it is, for what it is. Um, and it was worth playing, but we haven't discovered everything. So first things first, we're going to check out how to unlock the true ending. Um, and this requires us to save, like I was trying to do last time, save Maria. But I couldn't, because I missed this part of the game, which is reading her diary. And I am going to read this the, the diary for the first time, because I haven't, I, like I said, I was looking away when I skipped the text. I knew that this cutscene was going to happen, so I looked away. I got the achievement, but I don't know what happens. So I'm going to go back to it, and I'm going to read it for you. Um, hello Kyle, welcome to the stream. So if you guys are ready, let's jump in. So if you remember correctly, we had to reach the laboratory for the first time and we found Maria laid down and, and hurt. Um, and uh, I... For what I, I've been told, you get the key from Maria after she passes out. So the whole scene happened and you're supposed to go through that door on the left. So what happens is she fainted. But meanwhile, you can keep talking a second time, which I didn't do, and this happens. There's something by her feet. You got the room key. The room key is used all the way back in the archives. There was this locked door with question marks. We didn't know what it was, and that's exactly what we're going to do. Oh no, that's the cafeteria. So, alright, there's a... Okay, hello, ghosts. I do remember this scene from, um, from the first game, though. I think the ghost appears way before, like in the corridor back there. Um, as soon as you leave the laboratory, you see the ghost. Um, and I do believe that the key is under Maria's dress in the original and not by her feet which is funny oh the door opened see yeah that's, that's pretty cool it's pretty useful so there you can open this door um i think there was i think he was trying to say something all right cool use the room key and enter the void cool we can play darts awesome bed there's nothing much here even here in the drawer, there's nothing. That I remember, I explored this room er, this room quite a bit, but there's nothing. This is Maria's room. I uh, found a diary. Could this be Maria's diary? 
Read the diary? Yes. If you decide to read the diary, you get the information with you, and that's really good. Because you can unlock the final ending. I assume it tells you something about how to save Maria, but we'll see. Doctor, it has been a year to the, to the day since I came to this mansion. I will never forget that day. Food, please. Food. Give me food. Somebody. Food, somebody. Wow. A vagrant. She could be a fine subject with some work. It's pitiful to see one so skinny. Come to my home, please. I'll give you clothes and delicious meals. Nom 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 nom. So she got well served. Let me sip of my coffee. <sighs> Stay here. For a little while. I'll go tell my family about you. Family? I have a wife and a daughter turning seven. I'm sure they would welcome you. Family. Hmm. I like Maria's portrait in this one. Oh, oh that's the guy on the left. Okay. I see. Was this person taken in like... Like I was? <laughs> oh. What an awful... What awful injuries! It must hurt. Perhaps I could do something. There you go, bandages. Okay, I see, I see how it works. So basically we get the knowledge of bandages through the story. Or at least the drugs. Apparently, she's using the cloth of her own skirt to do to do the things. My skirt won't be enough cloth. Okay, I see. But the only other clean cloth I have is, well, the rest of your clothes, I guess. Naked Maria, avert your eyes, children. Naked pixels. This is a surprise. Coming from the brink of death, he made a significant recovery overnight. Yeah, it seems he was given excellent, excellent treatment. Did you treat him? Yes. How handy. You're exceptionally talented. Please, I... It'd be awful to let such talent go to waste. What is your name? Uh, um, I'm, uh, I am... Maria. Maria? An appropriate name. Maria, would you like to be my assistant? Oh? I do not wish to lose you. Please, stay with me. Well... Will you entrust the? Uh, will, will you entrust me with the rest of your life? Yes. And so it began, the story of Maria. I was so happy, so happy you had saved me. I was alone, but you made me needed. You gave me love, as long as I needed. As long as I am needed, I will stay with you. How c how could I live without you? I love you, Doctor. No, Maria. Maria. I never really knew anything about Maria, after all. Maria must really love Father, too. Alright, if you say so. So basically, this is Maria's diary, and you would get the achievement right now, as, as soon as the, the chapter ends.
Another funny detail that I noticed while I was replaying the game is that if you... Um, what was it? Oh, if you stand too close of the creature that goes down this hallway, the creature backs off. Back up. So it... It doesn't kill you, it just runs away from you, which is funny. And you, 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 uh, it happened when I was standing here or something. Oh, I think here or here, some, somewhere along those lines. So it, you, if the creature sees you, it will run back up. Yeah, it's only implied nudity. There's nothing. I was just joking. Uh, what am I doing here? All right. At this point, we can pretty much load the other save file because from then on, everything is the same. Nothing has changed. So... I don't want to go through the whole story again and waste your time. Let's close the game real quick and reopen it back up. Um, so, there you go, Mad Father, open, play Mad Father. There you go, thank you very much. Let's rearrange the windows as I had before so we can actually experience this full screen. Um, where is this? You won't notice any difference, but it still happens. Uh, so, you, now the screen may go crazy for a little bit and there you go that's good enough for me because the window open a windows open uh in a specific size and i have to readjust the size the two sizes available are either too big or too small <laughs> so there you go <coughs> um there's never any real nudity since the dolls uh naughty bits are removed yeah that's true that's true um if you go uh canonically with this so throughout the game I have this achievement that I showed you uh, before, the uh, Red jaw, uh, uh, Jigsaw, which is an achievement I never got in the game. So um, I'm not sure where to get it, but the only time we saw any sort of Jigsaw was the puzzle of Aya, I told you at the beginning. And that's why I'm going to check out right now, if there is something else about that puzzle. And I noticed in my second playthrough that there is something new that I also want to show you in this room. So this is the second playthrough of the game. So technically, you already made the jigsaw puzzle in the past. You already had that done. So what happens if you click the puzzle now? And that's really cool of, of the developer's part to actually add this feature. If you click it, you have the option to solve slowly or quickly. Slowly is basically doing the puzzle over again, while quickly is done on its own. You don't have to redo it. So there you go. Solved. Uh, but you have to do it once at least, which is practical. I mean, this is a um, time-consuming puzzle of sorts, but it's easy. So why is it there? There's a way to skip it, and that's great. I heard a sound somewhere. So technically, the sound here would open this door here, right? So this is how you can uh, progress, but... Yeah, I'm looking at my footage as well, and I see a drop of blood right there. Uh, and that, yeah, there you go. That's how you get the achievement. Um, so I assumed there was something because the drop of blood appeared. I noticed it. Um, but I didn't want to check it um, last time, so I didn't get the achievement. But there you go. You saw the achievement popping out on screen. Um, actually, you've been seeing the achievements popping out on screen, haven't you? Or is it just now? Well, there you go. This is the achievement you would get uh, for this room right there. Just looking at the jocks, uh, jo jocksaw, j jigsaw puzzle. Um, next up, actually, we're done with this save. Uh, it was actually to uh, try out for this. I thought it would take a little bit longer, but um, it, we didn't need to. The game has officially no way to save and quit or just, well, simply quit the game. You have to close it and open it back up which is not that great. If you ask me, there should be an options menu to just quit the game. But no, you have to close and open it back up. So let's go. Let's jump in to the ending part. This is where all the choices are made for the endings of the game. Uh, before that, the game is pretty linear. Make sure that you do the Maria's quest, the Maria Diaries quest first, and you'll end up here exactly the same. Bob. The nostalgia. Yeah, this game, this is a remake, and I've, I've seen the original, and I like both, actually. There's all, there's a few differences, there's a few differences, but um, the overall experience is the same. So let's jump in um, this vortex. That's all we have to do. 
is continuing on from this point onward. So she went. What will she choose, I wonder? Oh, I shall see this to the end. So here we go. Um, we're uh, back here, um, like before. Um, I'm not going to read that text up until the, the options we get. And I'm going to show you how this, the text is skipped in this game as well. So you don't have to go through it again. So you jump back here. Um, you get and you encounter mom and dad being very mad at one another. And what appears to be Maria on the side. Uh, so let's skip the text. Basically, there's a struggle. If you remember from last stream, you 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 saw this struggle. I read it out loud. We we went through it. it. It was very intense, up until the point that you get a choice whether or not you want to save father or you want to uh, grant the mother's wish. Um, in which case, we are going to choose grant mother's wish, which will most likely open up to another bad end. If I I think. It might even be the true end, but we don't know. I don't. I think the the safe father ending leads to something more, but I'm not sure what this one does. So we're gonna grant mother's wish and see if that's the case. So you get this little um, holy water or magic water uh, to throw at at, at the mother um, if you choose safe father. Aya will throw that bottle at her, and, and it will actually uh, push the mom away. However, if we, if we grant, grant mother's wish, we'll see what happens. I'm sorry, father. Mom, she loves you more than anyone. I can't take you away from, from mom. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. No. Dad. Just... Dad. And we are here. With no father. Where am I? Did I make it back? I wonder. It's just me. And we're in control, so the game continue. What? Died with blood. Um, yeah, last time we saw, this was actually the um, a, a clone of her mother. Seems familiar. A doll. It has a lonesome look. Stuffed something. A bright doll. Seems alive. I think this is meant to represent the family. And this is the hunter, like the wolf, you know? Um, the predator. Um, um, the father. This might be... This might be Maria, and this one might be... The mom, but I'm not sure, either of the two. And this must be us. Ah, oh, yeah. So, let's see. Oh, we don't have any... Um, okay, we don't have our, our weapon. So what I'm going to do... Uh, I have to be really careful with the saves now. Um, we don't need this one. As you can see, it took me one hour to go through the whole game. Hello, doll. So this doll is not going to save us. And we're not rushing. Because there's no need to rush. That's good. Oh, Maria. <clears throat> this sounds like the East Palace from music from the Link to the Past. <laughs> oh yeah, the other one. Yeah, yeah, it does. Um, it, ha it has some some chords that really remember us. That that song, at least it remembers me. Um, where is this mistress? Where's the doctor? What happened to him? Mistress, the doctor. No, no, he... You killed him. 
Doctor! Doctor! Maria, we just read your diary. We know how you feel. It's so quiet. The Christmas have faded. And father's gone. Hmm. I'm sure this is for the best. Now no one will be hurt by father's experiments anymore. You'd say the same thing, right, mom? But now what do I do? I don't have a father or a mother. I'm all alone. No, I shouldn't whine about it. I just have to live on my own from now on. You forget Maria. Maria, what will you do? You can't just stay here since father's gone. But if you have nowhere to go, then... Oh, Maria? Oh my god, Maria. Don't do that. Oh, dang it! I knew she was not to be trusted. Doctor, you are with us no longer, but please, take heart. I shall take on the duty, the future you wished for, the mistress, and I shall see it out, so rest in peace. <clears throat> Doctor, screw you, Maria, you- I love you. No, you don't! Ah, oh, bad end one. There you go. We got the achievement. So, Love is Madness. That's the name of the achievement. Wow. Alright, we got uh, both of the actual bad ends. The bad end for the game over is just a way to go back to the title screen, I guess. But now we go back to the choices. So, let's do this again. But this time, I'm... So, uh, it was obvious that there is no choice here. Like, you... You don't have anything else to do. You don't escape from father, you just die. <laughs> At the end of the, the whole uh, thing. So, what we're going to do is... I'm going to try to save father, and then try to escape father by saving Maria. Let's jump in. So we're gonna go back to the same ending we were last time uh, in in yesterday's stream, um, but this time we'll have um, we'll have the option to save Maria in a certain way. So that's what I gathered so far. Also, we still have the twenty-one gems, so the hundred percent route is still the same. It's exactly the same. As yesterday, but we read Maria's diary. That's the only difference. So we all we know what happens here, of course. Um, and man, I really want to figure out what what the extra stuff is all about. And no one shall interfere. You can hold the B button on your controller. If you're using an Xbox controller, you can hold the B button and it will skip the cutscenes. It's really cool. Not skipping, but like going really fast. It just skips the text. So now we're presented with the choice once again. And we're going to save father once again. And that's what happens if you missed stream the stream last time. This is what happens. We use the magic water and there you go. We defeat the ghost of our ma mother, of our mother. See, yeah, I admire that cutscene right there. Very unique, very well thought. I I, I love how the um, how the cutscenes are so 
they stand on their own so well. So now we're back with father, and you'll see what I mean by we had a, a mother's clone inside that thing. And that's exactly what we had, that's true. Father, yay, we're together again. Ghosts, you are here, you'll see the truth. Let me show you what really happened. Finished my coffee. Delicious. All right. This was kind of a shocker when we first read it. Actually, I was kind of surprised that um, if if I remember Fang uh, on the ch in the chat talking about the fact that we might have been a clone or something, but and I was I was actually kind of thinking the same. I didn't want to go too far because if that was actually the case, I didn't want to spoil it right away or. You know, because I, in the back of my mind, I thought it might have been the case, but no, we were all wrong. It was actually the father wanting to make a doll out of us, an actual doll to preserve our beauty and whatnot. So I was kind of a twist of events. That's not what the cutscene's about right now, by the way. Um, the cutscene right now is about the mother's death and how everything happened. Um, but this part of of being turned into a doll comes later. <laughs> Kyle! Thank you so much for the $5 donation. Are you planning on looking at the if ending after the true ending? Yes, I am, and I announced it. We are going to get all the achievements. Uh, so far, we're not on a good track for that. So, we are indeed going to, um... Strangely enough, we didn't have any blue saying thanks. Wall well, blue thanks. <laughs> Let's save. So... Yeah, this save we don't need anymore. It won't open. Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> Scary. Thanks, mannequin. <laughs> oh yeah. Open the goddamn door. Uh, yeah. I'm panicking. Panicking. Woo <laughs> Oh. No! <laughs> Gotta run! Yeah, my shit. Dun, dun, dun. Interestingly enough, I've always thought I had music. <laughs> in this part? Dang it! <laughs> it's always gonna trick me. <laughs> that movement is so unpredictable. Oh, wow, okay. That trick didn't work this time because it was too far to the left. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I probably need to go a little bit further down, and if I go here... Okay, he's gonna move now. There you go, there you go, 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 go. Nice. Bye-bye, father. That was easier. Maria. Where is this? Did I make it back? Doctor. Okay, where is the doctor? Mistress. Maria! Oh, sorry. Maria, don't let Aya escape! I love the psychotic voice I did last time. I don't know if I can replicate that. What do I do? No, I don't have a choice. So now we can save right here. That's good. A 
Let's try to escape from here. Because triggers. I'm gonna get you. Aya. I'm gonna get you. I'm not joking, it's just funny. It's like accents are are, are, are nice sometimes. It's like the phone do you, Aya. So yeah, um, basically, you useless, get sliced, bye bye, father runs around looking for her, and um, yeah, suddenly, we hear nothing. Now, door is open, but father is still around, so, oh, tell, Maria, what do I do? So much blood. See, that's already different. Is there anything here I could use? There you go. Now we can go here, grab some things. Is there anything here? Yeah, that makes more sense now. Got bandage. Doctor. A bandage. Well, I can't wrap this wound uh, with... I can't wrap this w uh, around your clothes. Um, lift your skirt a little, Maria. <laughs> you pervy. <laughs> this should help stop the blood. Mistress, thank you for caring of for me. It's fine. Don't worry about it. And you should... You should be mo most loathsome in your eyes. Okay. Um, don't say that. It's true. I've known you how you feel, mistress. Uh, I took away your most beloved. Of course, you wouldn't hate me. You would hate me. Um, but you are very kind uh, to show me such compassion. I'm sorry, my reading is worse than yesterday. Maria. Maria, can you stand? Mistress. Let's get out of here together. But, mistress. So after all, we do have um, notifications. Go figure. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Man, oh man. I'm the same as you, Maria. I thought I couldn't live without father. But the way father thinks of us. Hmm. I don't want to be a doll, so I can't be with him anymore. But you and I, we can't live we can't live alone. So let's go together. Even if father is gone, I know the two of us can make it. Mistress. Alright. Let's escape together. I shall accompany you. Oof! Oof! <laughs> Maria! <gasps> Apologies, mistress, but I... Uh, but could I ever... Uh, could I have your shoulder? Wow! Simple. Yes, of course you can. And we're walking. That's... yeah, cool. We can save. Oof! <laughs> Gotta run. So this it's exactly the same thing. I, I gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. It's just hurry. No! Maria! Mistress, never mind me, escape. No, we're leaving together. I can't go any further. You must escape alone, mistress. Oh, I can't go alone. Oh, it's fine. I shall not leave leave you alone. I will follow behind for sure. Believe me, please. Maria. You're dead. Oh, wow. Poor Maria. What the heck? 
All right, let's run, I guess. Uh, yeah. And close the door. Here's Johnny. Once again. Boo! Boo! <laughs> I found you! Ah! Good. <coughs> there we are. What? Goddamn dolls. <coughs> Apologize for the coughing. Come be with us. No, I don't. I'm going to kill you. Found you, Alice. Did I say Alice? Dang it, I love Alice in Wonderland. So beautiful. And that the clothing is actually most likely inspired by that. Um, That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go! Dang it. I didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No, f stop, father. But I can cover your legs with a skirt. Easy enough. So it should be fine. And I don't want this. I wanted to stay with you always. I love you, father. So please, please stop this. Aya. Don't worry, Father and I will always be together now, so rest in peace. I, uh, I love you! Your love I despise. Oh, there you go. That's how twists are made. Father! I... Love you. Uh, yeah. Father. Dag nabbit. <laughs> Mistress. Maria. Are you hurt? Maria! Father isn't moving. Did father die? I apologize, mistress. I had no other choice left to protect you. Okay. I guess it's time. I guess it's for the best. Right, mom? No. <laughs> oh, dang it! Wow, you don't die, don't you? Oh, Jesus. The guy is freaky. What a freak. Oh, he's back. I thought he died. I'm glad I made it. Mistress. Are you dying, Aya? Is this another bad end I don't know about? No, you guys just leave the mansion because. Yeah, I think that's the best option. And he saved us. Thank you. No need for tank for tanks. Wow. No need for thanks. <laughs> I just did what she asked. You mean my mom? I said I was sorry for uh, scaring you. I had no intentions of harming you. Believe that at least. Just when it gets to the fields, jump scare, genius. No need for tanks. <laughs> War tanks. <laughs> uh, I understand. Mom was trying to protect me. Thank you, Mom. I want to see her again. She wanted that too. But I don't think she wanted to, to be seen as she is now. That's... Whatever Mom looked like, I'd... Um, it's alright. She's watching from afar. 
you if watching you from afar uh, so don't be sad if you are it will only make her sad all right the curse will be uh, will wear off soon so it's almost farewell you'll go away we're all alive now only because of the curse I see but there's nothing I must um, there's something I must do before I go and that is to set fire to the mansion why would you can't do that all those memories of being happy here this place simply can't be left intact it's possible that someone could find it and continue your father's work we can't let the same tragedy happen again. Uh, let me get this straight. It's not the place that makes the people. It's the people that make the place. So it, you don't need to burn the mansion because anybody can do the same thing elsewhere. But whatever. Is that what mom wanted too? Okay. If that's what mom wanted, then do it. Mistress, it's okay, Maria. Even if this house is gone, my memories of father and mom won't go. Mistress, all right. You guys said mistress so many times today. Yes, that's right. Exactly. Just let one idea have this moment, lol. <laughs> I, uh... Uh, there is one thing I ask of you. Do never forget the people who were sacrificed here. None of us had any relatives. No one looked for us. No one remembered us. No one knew we existed at all. Our existence will be forgotten to the world. But we did indeed leave. Live. If I... <laughs> If I don't want you... Uh, oh, wow, so I don't want you to forget that. I want you to hold proof in your heart that we were here. That is the least you can do for us. Yes, I will never forget. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, this is goodbye. Wow, magic. Crud. Run. Mention. Uh, there you go, charm of happiness. That's the image. Goodbye, Aya. May you be smiled upon. Thank you, Dio. Now go. His name is not Dio, but that's become a meme now. Goodbye. Let's go, snowball. <laughs> Humans are such utterly foolish creatures. I have seen countless, many foolish humans. But you are the most foolish of them all. A human, mad with desire, is more fearsome than any demon. And yet, I adore such foolish humans. Come with me. Come with me and you may research to your heart's content. All in all eternity. It is just, just due to... Oh, wow. It is just the two of us now. Well, and Snowball. Oh, yes. That's right. What shall we do now? I don't know. We have to find somewhere to live. But I'm sure I can't live alone. Maria, will you come with me? Yes, of course. You have done much for me, mistress. Now it is time for me to help you. Whatever awaits us ahead, I wish to protect you all the way. Thank you. 
No, oh, darling. Let's go. Uh, are you sure? You don't want to watch it to the end? Yeah, it's fine. Alright, mistress. Actually, I wonder where that guy in the black coat went. Kinda hope he's okay. You know, that you, that uh, the scenes are kind of reversed. I would love to see the guy appear and say that to the father after she said that. Because that usually ties up very well. Uh, it, it creates a nice flow. But it's a shame. It's a missed opportunity there. I'm sure he'll be alright, though. Um, he's he's a really strange guy. Come on, Snowball. Father, mother, goodbye. I think that guy is Hitman. It's probably Hitman. Hitman. A book? It's a book. Book. Here goes Maria. Mistress? What is the matter? Um, nothing. Let's go. Oh, yeah, what are you doing? The mistress is very, um, hardy. Even after that harsh experience, she walks on without, she walks on without shedding a tear. With the mistress beside me, Oh, I feel we can overcome anything. However, hmm, what is the uh, what is this uneasiness that I feel, Doctor? Hmm. <laughs> oh boy. Beautiful. I'm finally here. I've heard about this place. Travis Clinic. Clinic? <laughs> yeah, this must be the place. It's out in the middle of nowhere. No one would even notice it. <clears throat> Don't like this. Well, it looks peaceful enough. Um, hello. Ah, a patient. Welcome. She's so pretty. Is she at the doctor? That seems to be what seems to be the problem. Yes, well, I was born rather feeble. I usually get checkups on my local doctor, but how do I say this? My family is really poor, so the doctor has given up on me. And that's why I came here. The doctor, uh, I heard the doctor here does checkups for free. Yes, we don't ask any money from our patients. But don't worry. Really? Honestly? I don't have any, so... I honestly don't have any, so... Um, I can really get examined? Of course! Thank you so much! I wonder why it's free. Uh, what's your name? I'm... John? Jean? Jean? I... Yeah, Rooney. Uh, Jean. I'm gonna call it Jean. Um, I think it's what... How are you supposed to read it? I'm stupid with names. Um, that's a wonderful name. I'm Aya Drevis. Yeah, I'm the guy actually who, um, yeah, it's Jean. Um, that's why I assumed. Um, I, I'm the guy who actually called, um, uh, Lynn from, um, from, um, um, Ghost Trick Phantom Detective. I called her Lynn, I called her Liney at the, at the beginning. That's how bad I am with names. <laughs> so, yeah, there you go. That's why I'm saying, <laughs> nice to meet you, Jean. Yes, you too. Ah, cough, cough. Oh, that, so that, that doesn't sound good. We should examine you right away. Come in. Come in. For, some, for someone who's not all that healthy, your legs sure carried you a long way. Was it difficult for you? I met a kind old woman on the way here. Uh, who took me um, part of the way to uh, by by coach? Oh, nice! It was a nice. If wow, it was so nice of her. There are some really nice people out there, just like you, Doctor Drevis. 
You think so? I'm evil. I'm evil. I'm, I'm gonna cut you down. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, man. Imagine, imagine if she actually... Uh, I don't want to think of all that. Now, lie down here. I bet father's gonna, like, break up, like, the wall all of a sudden. A ghost of father and is gonna kill everybody. Boy, I'm nervous. I hear horses. They don't sound far off. Are they in the back? Stay very still while I apply anesthesia. Ah, oh, yes. You have very pretty eyes, you know. Oh, so beautiful. I'm almost getting lost in them. <laughs> no one said that to me before. Thank you very much. <laughs> Nervous, huh? It's fine. Just relax your shoulders. Stretch the shoulders? Doctor. Um, Doctor, do you think you can make me better? Of course. From now on, you will never suffer again. So, take it easy. And go to sleep. Dagnabbit. Indeed, the mistress is much like you. It does run in the family. Doctor. Oh, man. <laughs> what the hell? Wow. <laughs> awesome. There you go. That that was the true ending, I guess. <laughs> Didn't get the achievement yet, so we probably have to wait for the whole credit sequence. And maybe something happens after the credits, so... <laughs> oh man. Wow. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that. I was kind of. Ah, uh, you know you can't leave a stream in the middle. Stuff kinda happened. I was going through the ending, so... It's probably not over yet. There's still more to see. This is not the final... This is not gonna end the stream right now. There's more stuff to, uh, to, to check. There's the if ending, and I don't know if there's anything after that. Then there's a museum to check out, so we have a few things to, to look at before we, we call it quits. Yeah. The girl who hid uh, a dead cat in her drawer. It, did she actually do that? I thought the cat was there because everything was like bonkers in the house. I didn't think it was her who actually put the dead cat there, but probably I misread something. Guess you got ripperoni pizza. Rip. Oh, there you go. There's more. Hmm. We promised. So I can't ever forget. And the promise. There you go. Achievement. Nice. What's next for us? Familiar face. Achievement unlocked. Nice. My. You have made quite a mess here. Well? Have you grown used to this lab? Oh. Dagnabbit. This girl. You still longed for, you, for your daughter, I see. I see. So her mature form served as... Yes. Of course. She shall come into my world as well. <laughs> I look forward to her birth. 
I hope you can someday show that girl your home world. You pervert. Oh man. Terrible, terrible. Terrible person. We are always together. My adorable Aya. Freako. There you go. Back to the title screen. So we have if and museum to check out. Let's check out if and continue on in this uh, still, I think, one achievement. Let me confirm that with you. We have 26 of 27 achievements. So yeah, that's technically going to unlock the last one. If is literally what it means if so it probably is an alternate ending to what we originally have so let's check it out i have no clue what it is probably i don't know if there's gameplay so i don't know how long it will be let's uh let's take a look shall we mistress 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 please come too Hmm. Is she alright? She seems to have fainted from shock. Mistress. Okay. So I see where we are right now. How's Aya? He's sleeping soundly. Just leave her to be for a while. Right. Um, will you be alright? Don't worry about me. I mean, I'm already dead. Are you truly a dead person? Huh? I'm sorry. You just seem different from the other corpses, somehow. I still sense life in your eyes. <laughs> in your eye? <laughs> so I don't... And so it's hard to think uh, of you as... Um, as dead. Well, it feels pretty unbelievable to me... Uh, that I'm up and about right now, too. I'm sorry about before. I mistook you for, for an attacker, so I impulsively threw a knife. Don't worry about it. I probably would have done the same thing. Thank you for say, saying so. Maria. Mistress? Let's stay together. Mist mistress? she awake? No. She, I think she was talking in her sleep. Adorkable. <laughs> what are we going to do now, I wonder? Not to mention you. We corpses are only being kept alive by the power of the curse. Once it's completely gone, I'm sure I'll vanish. I see. Even when you've uh, helped us, so I can't do anything for you. I'm truly sorry. Don't sweat it. It's um, this was always my fate, and no one can defy fate. Where would you be? Um, where would you be going? Feels weird sticking around in a girl's room. I can, um, can I borrow one of the other ones? I don't mind. Uh, use any room uh, that's available. Thanks. Alright. Good. You have to live and protect I am. That's your fate. That was Monica's wish too. Which is, um, yeah, which is why you were, you were left here, I bet. You need not worry. I already decided that I must live to support the mistress. Yeah. Oh. Oh, hi. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, <laughs> oh, I wanted to explore a bit. 
I thought I was going to go to the to um um uh, I think it was the clothes room. I think I I thought I was going to go left. I needed to go left, but I ended up here. So whatever. What are you up to here? Ah, oh, my my, how oh, good to see you. You're safe. Um, has that knife wound heal up already? Healed up already? You appear to have recovered quite well. Thanks to that medicine of yours. Good, good. Um, who in the world are you? You're not from this mansion. And you don't seem dead to me. I'm just passing a passing salesman. What an awkward guy. I've witnessed some amusing sights indeed tonight. Love is a truly magnificent thing, isn't it? For love, people will become crazed, fighting and hurting each other. How foolish. How pleasant. How pleasing. You're enjoying all this? And if I said I was? What the hell is your goal? I have no goal, so to speak. I just enjoy observing deranged humans. You're not human, are you? <laughs> But as of late, I've gotten a bit uh, bored with a mere observation. I decided to find some new amusement. Indeed, perhaps I, like he, would take part in a puppet show. Oh, shut up. No, you know. I like virtuous human like yourself as well. I wouldn't be uh, it wouldn't be entertaining if this world were full of nothing but lunatics. It is the presence of good people that allows lunatics to shine. Such is why I didn't let you die. So if you would, please, stand against the madman with your justice. When the time comes for it, I'll be watching closely. Right. Amusing. Wonderful. Fantastic. He's alive. The door's closed. Let's go back. Alright, so we didn't lose everything. You can't go outside. There's probably nothing here. Okay, uh, goes down to the basement, I'll check the other rooms, very well, how about this? Bathroom. Oh, you made it out of the toilet! You made it out of the toilet. Oh, that's the old man. <laughs> the youngster, hey. You first came here as a servant too, I, I'll bet. Same for me, but I wasn't like the others. I was taken in to be a servant, not a raw material. Not as raw materials. That was back when the woman was alive. As I worked here, I came to learn the true nature of this family. I fled in terror, fast as I could. But I couldn't make it away. So, I was pretty clever. About it, too. But that woman saw right through me. He's very sharp. She is. A woman who can't read minds can brainwash people, no problem. Yeah, she well and truly tricks you. Do you mean to imply Monica brain brainwashed that scientist? Whatever kind of person she is, her feelings about her daughter are real. She's a fine mother. Huh, well, what do I care? What, what do I care? I can, you can think what you like.
I was thinking, okay. I'm running with kill. Okay, cool. Okay, so you can't, you can't advance, you get the dialogue. Okay, I see. Cool, nice. Oh, interesting. Brainwashing. Hi. Is that a good room to be? Hmm, right. Huh, you also read the books. Okay, there's nothing here. I'm sorry, Snowball. I've always been, uh, you've always been at my side, but I kept thinking I'd be all alone. Will you forgive me? Oh, and Snowball too. Uh, is a dear member of the family. Snowball. What's with Snowball? Oh, they're right there. I see. Let's continue exploring real quick. Oh. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. That, that, so we were supposed to go there. That's good. Ah, good. You woke up. Yeah. Bye, I guess. I'm terribly sorry. The mistress seems a bit shy. We've decided to leave the mansion. Right. That sounds good. We're going to leave all our past being uh, behind in this mansion. The mistress and I will start on a new life now. Is something the matter? You don't look pleased. Be careful of that red-eyed man in the back in the black coat. What do you mean? Better not to ask that. He's dangerous to even it's uh, he's dangerous to even uh, get involved with. Hmm. Maybe um Oh, he may be in danger of the mistress? Very probable. I'll bear it in mind. Thank you for the feedback. I appreciate it. Well, this is goodbye. Flames everywhere. Die, everyone. You run. Ooh, oh, you just got spooked. Bye, Aya. May love them. Whatever. We're almost done. Now go. Run. Escape from your misery. <coughs> Goodbye. Goodbye, sir. Thank you for coming. Hey, we literally filled up one hour of stream just with that, so... That's something. Back at a lonely life again. My time here was my salvation. Uh, even given that uh, what happened there. Still, she saved me. Those few days were irreplaceable. Her hands may have been cold, but her heart was so warm. Why did she save me, though? I wish I had at least knew that. Glen Knight Falcon, welcome to the stream, and you, yeah, you most likely do, this is a very popular one. Aren't you going with them? Oh, sorry. Oh, it's a doll, okay. A doll? Guess the curse hasn't worn off completely. Hey, don't, don't you want to go with Aya? Won't you be lonely? No, I can't be with... The two of them. If they learned I was alive, I feel like they'd make me pay. They're trying to move forward, so I can't be dragging them down. Well, I'll be living on a different path of, from them. Oh, okay. Suit yourself, I guess. <laughs> that I will. Hey, do you believe in this string of, of fate? If you and Aya and Maria are bound by one one of those, then you might meet some somewhere again. <laughs> so long as we live in the same world, I can't deny that could happen. 
if you meet again, what what will you do if I has taken uh, the same path as her fa as her father? What do you mean? What else do I mean? Uh, don't they say that the apple doesn't fall far from fall f fall far from the tree? <laughs> that that's impossible. She knows the subject's pain better than anyone. Uh, to think that uh, th to think that uh, blah, blah, to think she would take the same path as him. I mean, I said if. Well, what do you do? If that happens, then I would stop her. Could you stop her? I would try to, no doubt. Hmm, well, good luck. Oh, I'm getting kinda sleepy. I'm going to bed. Good night. You freaky doll. Good night. It's not quite foreshadowing because we already saw the true end. <laughs> so yeah. Aya's future. The achievement unlocked. And with that, we actually got all the achievements. Let's check out the museum real quick. This is pretty much complete game. And this is what the museum has to offer. Characters. You have an insight of all the characters. Maria, Ogre, Mom, Bond Youth, <laughs> no name. Oh, so she represents all the subjects. Okay, I see. Music. The soundtrack of this game is really cool, so you can actually listen to it uh, on its own. That's pretty, pretty awesome. Wow. You can see all the artwork here. Pretty cool. If you click it, you remove the bar on the side, it's really good. Goodbye, mom, and goodbye, dad. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty good. There you go, good luck charm. That's the image we unlocked for the achievement. Some concept art? Nice. Awesome. Well, this game is packed full of good stuff. All right, there you go. We took a look at the museum. We I won't want to spend too much time looking at that, but you can actually, if you finish the game 100%, you can take your time and look at those artworks, listen to the music and all that. Read a little bit more about the characters. I think, I think it it's an awesome, um, an awesome, well detailed game for what it is. I think it, it's worth it. It's only five dollars on Steam, so. I think it's worth every cent um, to get the experience. Sadly, if you're watching this and you've never played it, I kind of ruined the surprise, but like I warned you of of spoilers, so there you go. So if, if you ask the reason why this stream is only like an hour or so long um, and we're already here, it's because we've already played the game yesterday. I've just came back to do the other endings that I missed and got the last few achievements that I've missed last time. So there you go. I showed you what I've I've I haven't done yesterday. And so if you want to get a recap of my reaction and my and the whole story, you can check um, the previous stream as well as as this one. Now, what I'm gonna do is uh, open the end stream chat time so we can chat a little bit and. 
I'm looking for suggestions for something to play right now after the stream. I'm going to cut down the stream, I'm going to shut it down and use the remaining time that I have to play something quick. Um, so I'll see you in the end stream chat time. Here we are. So this is the end of this stream, but I'm planning on streaming a second one right after. I'm not sure what is to stream. So if I don't have anything to stream for Halloween, I am going to not stream today. As simple as that. So if you have any ideas during the few minutes that will pass, I'm willing to try something very short. Again, I'm going to remind you an hour long game of an hour long horror game that is quick to install and prep so I can just start the stream right away and uh, and have it done. I'm open for your suggestions. If you need a real fast horror game, eight pages should do. Uh, again, Slender is better as a multiplayer game, I believe, but um, I'm uh, I, I don't know. I was ex I was expecting something a little different, but I'll consider it. So I'm still waiting for other ideas to see what what ideas uh, go around and what interests me most. Because 8 pages is the one game that you just run around the forest looking for pages and get them and and try to not get caught by Slender. Which can take a few minutes to finish or can take a few hours depending on your luck. <laughs> Arrival in Hell. Okay, I see. I would say E, but it takes three hours. That that was E was one of the games on my list <laughs> of games to play um, in the future during this this place this uh, whole Halloween special. So um, nice, nicely, uh, nice said. I'm not sure if uh, this was played, but you plan on going to play through of E. In the future well there you go I've already answered that um, probably I will uh, play Eve in the future I don't know if I'm gonna play it during this Halloween special because I only play during the weekends so I I'm not sure if I have time to do it and I kind of wanted to try Castlevania so that's one of the games that I had in plans um, but we'll see we'll see I just noticed Metroid music yeah this is the latest song of Metroid that um, I've done um, from Super Metroid, Lower Meridia, and I thought it, it fits the mood of Halloween quite a bit. <laughs> um, so th there's this game. So uh, let me. So for the new people here, I've 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 told talked about that yesterday. I said um, that in the past I had plans of playing three games. I called them the three hidden books, like you know, the storybook telling of horror stories and whatnot. And I w uh, my plan was to play The Witch's House, Eve, and The Mothfather. I only had the chance to play The Witch's House, because after that, there was not enough success on the series to continue on, so I never played Eve or Mothfather after that. Um, I quickly dropped the project, and I think I removed the, the videos from the channel. Um, so those three games, I really wanted to play. Uh, I had never played Mothfather or Eve, so... Um, I'm glad to be to I, I'm really glad to actually play them now and bring them back to you guys. So yeah. Castle fucking Vania <laughs> Monster Basement is another short horror flash game. Monster Basement, okay. Hmm. Yeah, during the during a little short break that I'll I'll be taking once I finish this stream, I'll I'll take a, a slight break of a few minutes and I'll look into those games, and um, I'll uh, I'll choose one of them and see which one catches my eye a little bit uh, more than the others. So 
as long as they're short, I'm fine with it. And, and if they fit Halloween, I'm also fine. Uh, as long as those two criteria match, I'll, I'll, I'll be glad to play. So I'll look into those for sure. Keep, keep coming suggestions if you want uh, if you want a game specific game to be played let me know um, for this uh, a short one so I so we can get a, a quick experience and once I finish the stream done I'm done with the suggestions I'll get ready for the next uh, stream in a few minutes so if you guys um, if you guys want to stick around feel free to stick around let's just make sure that you go to the channel and click the, the other live stream uh, that will start soon. Um, but yeah, I'll definitely look into those suggestions. Yeah, I, I wanted to play Spooky um, as a short game. You remember when I asked about this on, on Sunday, Spooky came to mind. But Spooky is a long game. It doesn't feel like it, but it is a long game. Yeah, it's really long. There's a, And there's more now uh, with the updates and everything, so... I've, I've played Spooky before, I never finished it. It's really long. Yeah, me too. That's why I don't, like, I also forget about those games, because they're short, they're not memorable sometimes, which is, it's a shame. But I know there's a lot of them, I just don't remember the names. Spooky takes forever, yeah. An hour and a half long? I think it might take longer than that. If you're speedrunning, there you go, okay, okay, I just read that. It also, uh, boring, uh, it's also boring for most of the rooms, yeah, yeah, because you, like, if it's randomly generated, you can't, like, really expect them to have always a good, a good room, right? I love that game regardless, yeah, it's a really cool game, it's a really cool game, I think, I think most people like the game because it's spooky and how cute everything is. Uh, and how well it manages to scare people. <laughs> Even with the cuteness. Uh, by the way, this song is going to be available soon on, uh, on uh, here on YouTube, on the channel. Uh, meanwhile, you can listen to the track on Tumblr, so that's what I meant by and Patreon as well. Patreon also has this song available. It was available way earlier for patrons, but uh, I never got around to publishing it, and it will come soon on YouTube. When I mean soon, I mean in the next few days. So there you go. One other song for the collection. Uh, if you guys haven't had the time to look around, look around the channel. We have tons of videos. We have uh, tons of music, tons of gameplay. Um, we tried out new ideas, and if you like any of those ideas, push push them forward. Tell tell um, uh, let let us know that we want to see more of that. Uh, that that's gonna be that would be great. So we can actually get some feedback from the community on on those. Um, some of them are left. Uh, some ideas sometimes are left aside, and and we never try anything alike again because we don't see much feedback on it. So there you go. <laughs> it's probably empty uh it's it's probably empty mostly for the ha for the atmosphere i don't know i would say it's just like it it is probably one of the factors but at the same time it feels like it's more because of being like like i said randomly generated you can't really have all the rooms look good, look like interesting if if you have a, a bunch of patterns to follow and you just want corridors to be in like empty rooms to go through um i i, I think it's fair that that um there are su su such rooms mainly when you have to run through a thousand of them right it seems fair Very well, guys. Um, three games were suggested so far. Uh, those three games, I'll keep those in mind. I'll look through them real quick, and I'll be back in a few minutes uh, to do another live stream and focus on that game specifically. Try to go through quickly. In 
You know, sometimes I look for things to do on Sunday because I need a short game to play, so I may even look into them and play them tomorrow as well. So what I don't play today, I can play tomorrow. Don't worry. I'll see if I can play tomorrow or not, depends on the time I have. Uh, and streams usually are earlier than this, um, so we'll see. We'll see how this goes. No, the game was originally not going to be a full game from what I remember. Oh, interesting, yeah. There you go, uh, but they actually made a full game out of it. <laughs> and they had to change the name. <laughs> Dang it, that was ridiculous. Why did they have to change the name? I have no clue. It just... Whatever. Whatever floats their boat, man. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching this stream. Don't forget, you can come back in a few minutes. Check out. Uh, you can also uh, follow on Discord to know when I'm live. So, just, just go there. Or on Twitter. And follow on Twitter as well. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. And goodbye.